I'm addicted to buying sewing machines, but I think you already noticed that. I got a new one. It's an 1800 sewing machine. Let's unbox it and see if it works. The unboxing. What? Ooh. Ah, see? Oh no. A lot of paper. Oh my god. I lost my knife. <sighs> now I know why I paid 30 bucks for packing and shipping. Oh my god! I'm drawing in bubble paper! The unnecessary sexual montage. Ich habe meine Nähmaschine ausgepackt. Das ist gut, das yes, it is good. Wow, oh, it's tiny. Yeah. They paid 217 pounds for it. I paid, I don't know, 80. The person I bought it from didn't know if it was complete or not, but it is complete. Like your mom. Like your mom. It's so, so pretty. Yeah, and she needs oil and cleaning. I need to find the serial number so I know when she was produced. No, that one's not. Here, maybe here? Yeah. Where's my phone? Ah! I hurt my back a little. This is a Wilcoxon Gibbs sewing machine. Hand crank. Everything's working fine. Everything is working! You just need a little bit of oil <laughs> and cleaning. Wilcox and Gibbs hand crank machine. Stereo number. 365393. This machine was built in 1863 and I am dead now. It's very old. Oh my god. Ah, let's clean this. Oh my god. Oh, exciting. Exciting. Don't even know what to do now. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, let's see what this amazing machine witnessed in 1863, shall we? These are a few facts that I found most interesting during that year. Don't at me, I got this info all from Wikipedia, okay? My researcher days are over, and for a long, long time. It was the second year of the American Civil War. President Abraham Lincoln proclaims that Thanksgiving will be celebrated on the last Thursday in November. He also signed the Emancipation Proclamation, freeing 3.1 million slaves in the Confederate States. There was an international conference in Geneva that 16 countries agreed to form the International Red Cross. The construction of the US's first transcontinental railroad started in Sacramento going up to Omaha. Henry Ford and Franz Ferdinand from Austria were born. This is the guy whose death started World War I. The French painter Eugène Delacroix died and talking about France there was even a French intervention in Mexico. Like really, France invaded Mexico City and I have never heard about it. Did you? And also the first section of the London Underground Railway from Paddington to Farringdon Street is officially opened. Seriously, this machine is almost 160 years old. Can you imagine that? What were you doing back in 1863? The cleaning. Let's clean these. I need to buy more canned air. I don't have any more canned air. Whoop. Mm, it's a little hard to crank still. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. It's definitely not a noise you want to hear. <laughs> Let's check. 
check the feed dogs. Yes, it's still working. I just need to take this plate off and clean it up. Oh my god! So exciting! Uh oh. Oh, I'll not be able to take this off without destroying the screw and I definitely don't want to do that because this is an original screw and original screws are important I think this is a one thread only machine Can you see anything? You can't, it's too dark with no bobbing necessary. This is the thread looper and there isn't a place to install a bobbin. What is this? Oh my god, that's the width of the thread. It's very dirty. You cannot really read what's going on there. When I move it, you have the stitch length. 30 stitches to an inch and 20 and 10. I have my journal here and some polishing compound and I will try to clean this plate because it is nasty. Hopefully everything will be fine. As clean as I can get without destroying the machine. Now the question is, will it sew? What do I need to do to make it sew? We need to oil anything on these parts. Yes. Listen to this. The sound of perfection! <gasps> Let's thread this and see what will happen. The threading! This is where you put the thread and here's a thread guide. So the thread will go, I think, directly here. There is another thread guide. Well, the tension is good. This goes here like this. Down here. There are no thread guides on the needle. From left to right. Lower the foot and let's take some scraps of whatever. Ow. Let's try to sew a single layer muslin first. Very tiny stitches. Bigger stitches. Biggest stitches. Something is binding. There. It sews and very nice stitches. It's a one thread machine, but it's so beautifully. If I pull the thread here, it will come undone. This is so perfect. Two layers. Curves. I ran it on empty and the thread cut by itself. I don't think this is a healthy thing to do with the machine, but... And the stitch is knotted, so I don't know if it's supposed to happen this way, like be an automatic thing, but I, I think I will remove it by myself. Great curves, great stitches. I'm in love with this machine. The weirdest bunny. I need to test the machine with a simple project before going into the big one. Let's sew the weirdest bunny ever. In case you want to get the sewing pattern, head up to my Facebook group and you can download it there for free. Whee! Link in the description. Cut all the pieces minding the seam allowances. First, sew the face seam shut. Then sew the ear pieces right sides facing, turn them inside out and reserve. I am using two different colors for a little more detail on the body. On the front body piece, sew the belly detail to attach it. I cut with pinking shears to avoid fraying. Back to the ears now. Pull the sides inwards like so and pin them to the front piece upside down and right sides facing. Pin the back piece to the front and sew all around, leaving a hole for the stuffing. Cook. Oh, the camera, but the gun side This is the simp dance. The simp simp dance. The simp dance. The simp simp dance. This is the simp dance. Simp simp. I'm trying to sew peacefully and you are doing... Oh my god! Ah! And help! <laughs> Turn it inside out. Can you give me the No. Stuff it with the insides of an old pillow or even fabric scraps. Wow! You packed a gift. Two! Two! Yes! 
Excuse me? Close that hole with a machine or using a letter stitch. Whichever you choose. Embroider the eyes and nose in the most mediocre way your earthquake hands will allow it and voila! Look at the sheer panic on his face. He knows he's going to get destroyed. Say goodbye to the world, bunny. You were born to die. Do you want to keep it or should I give it to Sushi as planned? Mine. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's so, it's perfect. It, it, it works, it works. I paid 120 pounds with shipping approximately and I bought it on eBay auction. And the sisters were going for 500 bucks. I am very, very, very happy. And this is an 1863 sewing machine. The cutest thing I've ever seen. It's in mint condition. It's just missing the cover, but I don't keep them covered anyways. So happy. Now I need to find something to sew on it. <laughs> I told you she was going to go for the iceberg. <laughs> <laughs>